Hello everyone, welcome to Freedom Fighter 2127. I come to you with some very alarming footage. This was posted on April 12, 2015. Here is the actual video. Um, I will leave this so you guys can go and watch it for yourselves because it is astonishing. But first of all, I want to read this to you. Marine Corps Logistics Base Barstow is a United States Marine Corps supply and maintenance installation located east of Barstow, California. Its mission is to rebuild and repair ground combat and combat support equipment and to support installations on the west coast of the United States. Today, one of the MCLB Barstow's most important facilities is the Marine Corps Logistics Bases Marine Maintenance Center. The only other facility of this kind is located at MCLB Barstow's sister installation, Marine Corps, uh, Corps excuse me, Logistics Base Albany. The base is located on Interstate 40, 3.5 miles east of, city, of the city of Barstow. The, best, the base lies at the junction of three major highways systems of I-15, I-40, and SR-58. It's the hub of all West Coast rail traffic for the Burlington Northern Santa Fe and the Union Pacific Railroads and in the immediate proximity of the Barstow Daggett Airport. It is also approximately 98 miles from the Marine Corps Air Ground Combat Center, 29 Palms. The base is within, within 150 miles of the two major seaports of Los Angeles and San Diego. Okay, well that's enough about that. You're going to be really, really shocked at some of these pictures. Uh, loading preview, hang on one sec. While that loads, I'll, I'll explain what he was going on about. He drives back and forth. Well, actually I could just read you this, huh? Uh, the description of the video. Just off of the I-15 north of Barstow, California, Yermo Logistics Marine Base. I travel past this place on a regular basis. I have never seen so many vehicle, tanks, MRAPs, Humvees at this location ever. In my opinion, this uh, is clearly a build-up to something much larger. There are actually maybe five, five times more vehicles that you can't, there that you can't see in the video. I made another uh, video, same area, way different outcome, kinda. I don't. I haven't watched this one. I just watched the first one. This was posted again on April 12, 2015. I'm trying to get these pictures to play. Okay, so if you can begin to see here, rows and rows and rows. This is this is according to him. Rows and rows and rows and rows and rows and rows, and rows of MRAPs, vehicles, military equipment, and from for me that appears to be coffins. I can't exactly tell. Um, but we all know about the FEMA coffins. But I can't be precise, but it appears to be so. If you see what I'm talking about. It was better in the video. I can't play the video because I'll always get you for uh, third-party content. But here, there's just more of them. Those are generators, light generators, and so on and so forth. Tanks. What's the common thing that a lot of people are seeing right now where Jade Helm locations are? Tanks. For what? Fort Irwin Road, one mile. He just gave a, a general um, place of where he is. Now, according to him, you can't see all the vehicles that are here because they're all like in depth in his video camera or his phone. It doesn't capture the best pictures, but it does. We get the drift. Look at all of this equipment. Here, that was the best one I think of the... They appear to me to be coffins, but I'm not sure. And there's rows of them. I can't exactly tell if those are or not, but that's just, hey, just spitballing here. I wonder what's in the storage containers. Because there's these here, there's a few of them. I don't think I got them in the snapshots. But here, if you can see, they just go back for rows, hundreds per row of military vehicles. Look at all of this. These are all MRAPs. Shocked yet?
dangerous times we live in. Coming up next in the next video I'm going to be producing, MNOL and I have been doing a lot of research on uh, more, more of on Jade Helm. It's going to scare you because it scares me. I think it scares about every single conspiracy theorist, truther, YouTuber, you name it, because the depth that this is going to supposedly go, whether it be a drill or not, this, this sort of thing is coming. And the true meaning of Helm not only stands for homeland eradication of local militants, but it stands for something much darker and much greater because it also affects your soul. And I mentioned it a bit in the previous video. It's about mapping. But there's another section of mapping that's even worse. That's all the news I've got for right now. Stay tuned for that video. I will leave the links uh, to his video in his second video. Um, that's a lot of military equipment. God bless. Be safe. Please check out the websites freedomfighterreports.com and exodusplan.net.